Hi, I'm Eugene Levy. And I'm Dan Levy. And we're delving into words that will never find their way into a dictionary. I think they have. So, uh... Fam. Fam, yes. Do you, do you have do you, a clue? Do you have a clue? Well, fam is something you use to uh, talk about how popular somebody is without actually going to the word fame. It's like an abbreviated version. Cooler than fame. That's the way I've heard it. Fam, I believe, means sort of your family. So like, thanks for the love, fam. Like a group of supporters. So you're saving yourself two syllables. Yeah. Oh, lit. Well, of course, as we all know, that stands for English lit. Lit means that something's like hype. That something's like, you know, really on fire, like it's cool. This party's going to be lit. My cigar was lit. You could say that. What's next? Uh, bye. Bye. Uh, pronounced bay. It is a term of endearment that people use to talk about people they have crushes on, people that they like, people that they love. It means before anyone else. Yeah, so you would say, I, I did this interview Bay. No, that's not it at all. Okay. It's in well, reference to a person. Up. This person is Bay. Oh, right. So Adam, let's say, in the book of Genesis, quite in the Bible, literally you would say bae. quite literally is Bay. Yeah, sure. Extra, to me, is still, what's the headline? What's extra the headline? Extra, read all about it, you mean? Like, yeah. Like in Newsies. Yeah. Extra means to be extra. This person's being extra right now, meaning like they're being dramatic and no one wants to deal with it. Performative in a way that's not welcome or comfortable. Oh, well, I'll buy that because that actually sounds... Like me. Oh, uh, TBH is an expression that means you are about to say something, you are about to be heard. Um, to be honest. TBH means to be honest. If you texted TBH meaning to be heard, I don't think you'd get the response you wanted. I think I could probably find the emoji that expresses to be heard. What would the to, to be heard emoji look like? <laughs> oh, I mean, you'd have to be born on the planet Neptune not to know what Gucci means. It's a descriptive of how stylish somebody is. You say, wow, you are Gucci. Or Gooch, I've heard. Gucci means like what's good, like like what's Gucci. Hot or hip. But what about what if you just shorten it and said Gooch? Or what, well, why don't you just gooch? say Wagoo? If we're going down that path. One more. Hundop. Or is that Hundo? No, there's a space. I. Hundo. I have to go, but I don't have enough time to actually say it. So it comes out as Hundo B. <laughs> You're not wrong, um, but you're also not right. Hundo P means 100%. So if I were to be in complete agreement with you, I could say, yeah, dad, Hundo P. We wrote wow. it into our show as Honey P. Right. Right, which means 100%. I think my definition was a little closer to the truth on that. I don't think so.